Everything's about to get better. Today, what's wrong with John Gosselin? And what about Spencer Pratt? In the beginning, they are very charming and they sweep you off your feet. The personality problem that plagues many men and how to make sure you don't get fooled by it. Next on Better. What to do when it's all about him. Advice to get your guy to get over himself. The hardest thing with a narcissist is they lack empathy. They have zero empathy. With couples like Heidi and Spencer Pratt or John and Kate Gosselin, it seems as if narcissism is the new buzzword and a hot topic in the media. While you may not be dating a self-obsessed man right now, chances are you have probably fallen for one at some point or another. We all have. Lisa Scott, author of It's All About Him, is here to help you examine the men in your life and to help see through those charming facades. Hello, Lisa. Hi, thanks for having you me. You are speaking through very personal experiences. Yes, indeed. <laughs> your ex-husband, tell us about him. Yes, well, my ex-husband was diagnosed with pathological narcissism but I didn't realize the implications of narcissism on a relationship until eight years into our our relationship so he joked from day one about being a narcissist I thought oh he's confident anyone can see that and then certain events in my life forced me to look into the true meaning of it and how it impacts the relationship and when I did it was a very big aha moment which is essentially why I wrote my book to help others understand narcissism. And it can be very hard to see a man oh, yeah. who's narcissistic, to oh, see yeah. them for what they really are. Well, Talk in about the beginning, what to look for. Yeah, in the beginning they are very charming and they sweep you off your feet. You know, a narcissist, uh, we're all narcissistic to a certain degree. There's healthy narcissism and then there's unhealthy narcissism. Unhealthy narcissism is when it gets to a point where you are so consumed with yourself you can't see that another person has feelings. You're just consumed with your own world. And so it makes a relationship difficult. But in the beginning, they appear empathetic, mm -hmm. they great actors. Narcissists <laughs> make great actors. They seem charming, charming and wonderful. Yeah, so there are some signs to look for, as you mentioned in the beginning. One is if he's too good to be true, question it. You know, he there's a reason is. for the old adage, it's too good to be true. A narcissist will figure out what you want in a man or women because women could be just narcissistic but they'll figure out what you're looking for in a mate they will become that character take on you know whatever those qualities are you're looking for and then lure you in Ooh, that's how they lure you in now yes. what do you do if you have been hurt or if you're dating a narcissist right now or right. married to a narcissist right and the thing you need to do which is is why i wrote my book is you need to understand that a narcissist cannot change a, a pathological narcissist, which is when it gets to the point that it becomes an illness, they're so consumed or obsessed, they cannot change. So you either have to accept them for who they are and all of their limitations because they are emotionally stunted, or you need to move on. And so I have a message board where hundreds of women and men are talking about their relationships, trying to love a narcissist, and what that's like. Uh, so it's, it's something that I really think you need support and you need to talk to others that understand. But at the end of the day, you just really need to ask yourself, is, you know, am I going to accept this or am I going to move on? And, and the, the hardest thing with a narcissist is they lack empathy. They have zero yeah. empathy. But in the beginning, they seem so sensitive. Yeah. They well, so they put out an act because they know it's not normal to have zero empathy. They're incapable of empathy or love, and they know that's not normal. So in the beginning, they'll put on an act in order to charm you. And once you settle down with them, you realize, oh, gosh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And, and it makes so relationship much, Lisa. difficult. It Thanks makes it very difficult, me. and yeah. these are very good tips. So if you feel like you're in a narcissistic relationship and you need some tips for making it work or even breaking free, pick up It's All About Him, even just for the adorable cover art there. It's available now.